Yo, this morning has been the most irresponsible morning of our lives. Not good. We, I don't even know where to begin. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another vlog. So it's day two in Wisconsin. I just pulled out my little vlog camera right now just to get this going because let me tell you, we are so late. We went to bed last night at 5.30, woke up at 7.30, and then a lady that's like running the event we're doing texted me and said, can you meet us in the lobby at 8? And I'm like... Oh, sh and I'm like, yeah, we got this. So it's eight o'clock. Dustin was still editing, and then I hadn't showered yet, and there was just a big fuss. And then I came in here. This is where it gets even more irresponsible, okay? Look at this fancy shower, okay? See this? There's shower heads on the walls and everything. And I couldn't, I literally couldn't figure out how to work these two things. So I'm like, you know what? I haven't taken a bath in a while. So I waited for the bathtub to fill up. I took a nice, jolly old bath. And then I go to my phone, and there's 13 cars and a bunch of grown ups waiting outside for us. And then I'm like, Oh jeez! Look, Dustin. Dustin doesn't even have time to turn off the sink. I got you, bro. It's all good. Now we have to um, kind of rush down there as fast as we can. Dustin's just getting ready, and then I'm kind of pretty much ready. But yeah, look at our hotel room really quick. I wish there was like more time for us to film in here, but I'm literally filming while Dustin's getting ready. So we have this really creepy little den thing going on here. Super nice, super nice. Got a got a nice little TV in here. Come out here. You already know. I don't know what this is, but then there's all these snacks. That we like ate, but I feel like no one ever eats these snacks, and they were really stale. So that's a fun fact. These st snacks weren't that good, but they're like six bucks each, so that was kind of kind of sucks. And then we got the really nice bathroom that's way too nice. And then last night, freaking Dustin over here ordered himself some. I just kind of. Um, Dustin ordered himself some room service, and I didn't want room service, and I ordered room service. We called them, we're like, did you get our order? And she's like, oh, the, the room service lady went home. I'm like, what does that mean? It's five in the morning. All right, all right, we're good. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hey, we're gonna go to the lobby and kind of see what's going on. I don't know any of these people. None of these people. Hello. Good morning. Uh, what's up? I'm Ariel. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Sorry, Hi, nice to meet you. Nice okay. to meet you. So, um, we're gonna go to the track, and you want to drive? Sure. All right, so you'll drive here. If not, I could put you in that Ferrari 458 as a passenger if you want yeah. to go in. Good luck over there. Right. You, what car are you going in? The 458, so. All right, man, good luck, good luck. Okay. Ooh, look at all these cars. Holy hell. Wow. Uh, you can hit the, well, that might be in the right spot. Record any of that, but that was my first time driving a Bentley. Thank you, man. High fives. Of course. Yeah, boys. All right, so now there's a bunch of cars pulling up. Dustin is in there. Yo, Dustin's booing. Look at Dustin. <laughs> was that not? That was the Bentley. Oh, I went like pretty fast. This boy's got the computer, guys. We're trying to upload. We haven't uploaded yet. We didn't have time. I blame it. I blame it on Dustin. Blame it on. Hi, nice to meet you, Tanner. Yeah. Well, I mean, I should probably tell you guys what we're doing. I mean. It's kind of obvious we're at the world championship for tennis. I can't wait to see it. Oh, we are we are in fact at a at a racetrack and there's a lot of supercars. And Tanner does have an F12 to drive on a track. It's gonna be fun, guys. I just like literally got invited to drive a Ferrari on a track and I've never driven on a track and you guys know that's like one of my big dreams and I can't wait, I'm so excited. There's a bunch of adults and I have to I have to to keep my cool. Yeah, no, no, I no, chill yeah. bro, hey, chill, 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 chill. No, yeah, keep my cool, I'll keep my cool though. Look at this guys. I just drove this back. Boom. Have you print and sign on the same line there? Hit me your wristband. Thank you. Thank you. Gang, 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 gang. It's finished. It's finished. We need to now. We need to put it on a memory card to give it to my computer. Drivers bro meeting. Yeah, dude. I got. I got to go meet about driving and stuff. I have no idea how we're gonna upload today's video, but it's gonna work. We have to go do a driver's meeting, and then it's gonna be fun. We're gonna go do stuff. I'm really tired still because we got an hour and a half of sleep. I need to. Oh, I have even caffeine, bro. Fuck. <laughs> the struggle is over. We are bustin' over, I'm bustin', I'm flossin', I'm flossin', I'm bustin', but this ain't Hugo. Alright, I'm back in my Bentley. I got my son in the back there. <laughs> my yeah. son, I gotta drop off at school. <laughs> Alright, so we have to go get helmets and we got all our wristbands and stuff. I gotta do some ride-alongs with an F1 driver, which you guys will meet in a second. And then and then I get to drive a little bit, which will be snazzy. You ready, dude? 
What's it, dude? Dude, that was insane. I got an iPhone clip too of like the speed. This, dude, the speed goes right there. Dead ass. I felt like it was gonna throw up. Yeah. <laughs> It's literally you're looking for, I gotta get an iPhone clip of it, but for all those who are watching, you're going, you see like a turn, and you're like, we're going 135 miles an hour, there's no way we're gonna stop. And then he slams on the brake, you go, and then you can hear that, you can like feel the car like barely stopping, and then you somehow make it around, and it was gnarly, bro. Dream car. It's my turn to drive now, I've never driven on a track in my life. <laughs> Way through, I turned the windshield wipers on. Oh, you did. <laughs> and then I tried to turn them off while I was driving, and I kept turning them up. So they were going like super fast, and yeah. I was like, crap, I need to get off so I could turn these off. And then somehow I turned them off. That was my first time ever on a track. Yeah, that's amazing. Make, right. Just make sure the traction control is off and you keep your foot on the gas at all times. All right, now I'm getting in a, a, a Turbo S here. Hey, <laughs> Yeah? Yeah, you need to do this. We've been here for about three hours. We have to go to the airport in I think two and a half. And I drove an F12, I drove a Turbo S, and uh, I went in the F12 with an F1 driver. The only American F1 driver for uh, an American team called Haas, I think it's called or something like that. So insanely crazy day, guys. This has been a dream of mine for so long to come to a track and to actually get to do it on one of like America's most like famous tracks from what they were saying. Look at all these cars here though. Like this is so cool. Everyone here is so nice. I just, I've taken a ton of pictures with a lot of them because I guess a lot of their kids are fans of me, which is awesome. And I'm just like so stoked to be out here, regardless of me getting four hours of sleep in the past two days. This is what it's about, is coming out and doing cool things and living. Like I, I would much rather tell this as a story than say, oh yeah, no, I slept until 12 this morning. I don't know, it's just, it's just, just like random thoughts I'm having right now because I'm just taking this all in. And this is just, it's just a cool experience. Like. To get to say I came from Hawaii yesterday to driving an F12 on a track to then going to Canada in two days, it's just cool, like I'm busy. We literally have to be at the airport in like an hour and Dustin is ditching me to go in the 458. The 488 is actually a car that I want so bad behind a LaFerrari, so maybe I'll go like 488, F12, LaFerrari, one day. But that's like one of my favorite cars. He's in a 458, but it's like the same thing. And I'm so jealous. He's right here. Now I know how it feels when I was in the F12 and doing all that stuff and he just had to sit here and film. Bye Dustin. Today just keeps getting better and better. You see this right here? This is an MP4, MP4 12C McLaren key and I'm about to drive it on the track. Holy frick. To think I'm about to drive this. This thing is insane. This is uh, another one of my dream cars, guys. I, I, I like a lot of cars. Yeah, he wants you to move. Thank you so much, man. No problem. Okay. What is this? Bro, you didn't even know. You what left me, so, I, so I, I left you, bro. You no. Left and me. I couldn't even film in there. I got like a little iPhone clip before I went. I guys. In the McLaren. Oh, about a sun. Yeah, this is so clip before I went. Guys, 
I know I have like so many dream cars and I'm like I like so many cars, but that was like my, by far my most favorite car I've ever driven. Like I've asked people that's been in McLarens and they always say it's different and it's it's so different, dude. The sounds it makes is insane. Like I just Okay, I feel like so much has gone on today. I should probably just sit here and kind of talk to you guys for a second. So basically, Cannonball is like this big uh, car event. It's basically like Gold Rush Rally, like those kind of things. They're driving cross country and they invited me out here to Wisconsin to like play around at their track date. They have this entire place rented out and they invited me. So if you guys want to check out the Cannonball, uh, I'm going to leave their link to their website in the description below. Check them out. It's a super awesome event. I'm so stoked to be here. I just drove a McLaren and let me show you something, all right? So this is my, this is my GoPro. It's a pretty handy little piece of technology, you know, because of my other GoPros in my GTR at the shop, so I don't have that one. So this is my old GoPro, right? Super cool, got my suction cup. Oh, gonna film some dope clips. Watch this. <laughs> dead. It's dead. I couldn't even film in the McLaren. Ugh. And then my friend Dustin, he's a super great guy. He was in a, oh, he was in a 458. Couldn't even film me. So I had to do it myself. You know, don't you hate when that happens when your friend's in a 458 and you're trying to drive a McLaren and he can't film you getting in the McLaren? It happens to me all the time. Um, I got like a little iPhone clip out there before I went and then I drove it and let me tell you guys, that was my most favorite car I've ever driven. Like, the rear engine, you can like, I've driven Huracans and Audi R8s and all that stuff, but like, in a McLaren, I don't know what it is, like, you can just feel the power from behind you and it makes like the gnarliest noises and by far my favorite car I have ever driven. I just did that on the track for I think 20 minutes I was out there. Like just freaking doing it. Yeah, that's my first time on a track. I drove an F12, uh, Turbo S, and the MP412C. Sorry if it's kind of choppy. We've just been having so much fun driving cars and having fun and meeting new people and hanging out with everyone here. Everyone here is so freaking awesome and cool. And Dustin went to ride in, what'd you go in? A Corvette, Z06, and, six and a 458. A four so everyone's just taking us for rides in their cars. Look at that, that's the f I wait. No, that's the car I drove. I drove. How awesome is that? So uh, we actually have a car picking us up in 15 minutes to go back to the airport and hopefully gonna get some sleep. Also, I apologize for my video today being late. Cause I need to go do, I need to go make my thumbnail. I haven't done that yet. And it's already uploaded, I just haven't made it public. So I'm really sorry if yesterday's upload load was late. Yeah, yeah, we're Super late. late. Super we're late, 20, We're 20 minutes late now. We're leaving in 10 minutes, and I'm gonna make my thumbnail in the car. So it's gonna be a little late, and I'm sure you guys are tweeting me, but so I'm really sorry about that. We're Man, that's that's okay. an update on today, guys. It's been incredible. It's been a day. And it's been yeah, a day. massive shout out to Cannonball for flying us out here, flying me and Dustin out here so he can film me. We can have fun and literally just have fun with them. And it's been awesome. I just want so many cars now. Like, it's so hard. My breaking point to buying my GTR was when I drove Roman Atwoods. Like, I drove it, and then I was like, okay, this is it, done, need it. And now I've actually, like, got to drive the crap out of a Ferrari, drive the crap out of a McLaren, and drive the crap out of a Porsche. It's fun, it's fun. It's, it's a lot of fun, guys, and it's like, one day, guys, one day. You gotta dream big, you gotta, you gotta manifest the items, and you can get them. Anyways, I'm gonna stop talking now. We're gonna wait for our car. You do. Wait, 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 how is he out there? I don't know. I, this was in my pocket. I, I have the McLaren key in my pocket. That's not good. Did I just steal a McLaren? Stole a if McLaren. We, what if I left with this in my pocket and he stopped it? He wouldn't be able to turn it back on and we would have to go to the airport. He would have been pissed. This is in my pocket. Oh, okay. I don't know how the car's going. <laughs> I don't know either. <laughs> I think I would leave him, bro. Time, dude. I don't want to leave It's my man from last night, bro. Yeah. I just saw you. A new we day. just saw you last night. It's a new day, it's a new dawn. This time we drove a bunch of cars. And now, see that? You see me like vlog and then give it to Dustin? All right, we're headed back to the airport, guys. We got a flight to catch. We got an hour drive to the airport and then like probably seven hours of traveling. Yeah, okay, let's well, bye. All right, we made it to the airport with like 10 minutes to spare. We're gonna get some little weenies and some little buns. Some little weenies. And then we're going back to San Diego. So I think that's gonna do it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to drop a thumbs up. Uh, I'm just kind of doing this fast because I'm like really tired. I'm, guys, like me and Dustin are tired. Let me tell you. Let me tell you on another level. Oh yeah, he can just take the camera and do that for me. So we're headed back to San Diego. Uh, wow, we drove some cool cars today. We did some cool things. We got to order some food. Let's roll the outro. I wish you were so good.